everybody. I hope you're having a massively spectacular day. And today we are going to concentrate on resilience. Now, resilience, I want to talk about ants. Yes, you heard me rightly, ants. Small termites come in a couple of thousand. Where are um, ants kind of, what's ants relevance to what I do? So let me tell you the story, set the scene. Uh, I love being around positive people. I love doing positive things. And earlier this year, I went on to a uh, superbly energetic and super, super positive uh, weekend crash course by a uh, rather popular uh, property investor and um, really, really enjoyed his energy on stage. And um, he told the story of ants. Now, I've always thought about resilience, uh, that we think about barriers and overcoming barriers and things like that. And he gave an absolutely excellent adaptation of the story of ants. So I want to share it with you um, because it inspired me to think a little bit more. So when we think of ants, uh, small termite creatures, absolutely thousands of them, they don't just turn up in one, um, they come together and they work as a team. So a couple of thousand ants rocking along, hit a wall. What do they do? The first one doesn't turn around and say, hey guys, um, we've just hit this wall. Um, we are this big and the wall is this big. Uh, we've got absolutely no chance of getting over this wall. So should we go back? No, they don't do that. Absolutely no, they don't. So the ants, um, they'll start to look at the wall and they'll probably firstly attempt to scale the wall. They go up the wall. And if they can't do that, they go look at going around the wall. And if they can't go around the wall, um, they'll probably come together and work out of may maybe a strategy. I don't know. Don't talk ant. Um, and then if they can't go around the wall and they can't go over the wall, um, they'll bury under the wall and they'll start eating under the wall. And if they can't go that way, the pesky little mites, they're not mites, they're termites, will eat the wall. They'll eat the wall. They'll go through the wall. So my point to you today is, guys, is that whatever you are um, facing as a challenge, whether it's in your personal life, whether it's in your working life, whether it's in your successful life and your business, doesn't matter. What I'm saying to you is think of yourself as an ant. OK, not so small, but if you think about yourself with the passion and positivity to overcome any barrier, doesn't matter what's in your way, you will do it. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. This is Claire Bell. And I'll see you soon.